welcome back to my channel i'm sanya in today's video i will be discussing some paid traineeships in europe that you can apply to so the first question is what is a traineeship so a traineeship is an education and training program which incorporates work experience preparing young people for their future careers by helping them to become work ready so in simple words a traineeship is a training program that you can get to increase your skills to increase your knowledge and to help kickstart your professional career so before entering the professional world you can get a training and you can see how work is done in the practical world in the professional world so the european parliament is providing these traineeships to university graduates and even if you have not graduated yet and are about to graduate you can still apply and the main purpose of providing these traineeships is to provide an insight about how work is done in the european parliament and the best part is that these traineeships are paid and they can be undertaken in three different places which are brussels luxembourg and strasbourg and there are different units that you can apply to such as hr accounts finance it and there are plenty of more units i will get to it later today i will be discussing two traineeships that you can apply to so let's get started So this is the main website which has all the traineeships and I'm just screen recording the one that I'm going to talk about. So the first one is European Parliament Schumann Traineeships. So if you go down, you can see the goal of this traineeship is to contribute to EU citizens' European education and training and to provide an insight into the work of the European Parliament. And just like I told you, they are paid and they can be undertaken at one of the following places. And the eligibility for this traineeship is you must be aged 18 or over. You must be nationals of a member state of the European Union, but a very limited number of traineeships to nationals of other countries can also be offered. So if you are from a non-EU country, don't worry, you can still apply. There are a few spots reserved for you. You must hold a university level diploma. You must have a thorough knowledge of one of the official EU languages and a very good knowledge of a second. And if you are a citizen of a non-EU country, you just have to have a very good knowledge of one of these. So if you are from any of the non-EU countries, such as Pakistan, you just need to have a good knowledge of English. And you need to provide an eligible criminal record. And you must not have worked in the parliament before. This was the eligibility criteria. And then the duration is five months. And the starting date is either 1st March or 1st October. So if you apply now, you can be selected in the March program and the payment that you'll get per month is 1480 euros and the deadline is 31st May or 31st October depending on which program you want to apply for. So you do have time to apply for the March one, you can apply and the deadline is 31st October. So you have a whole month of September, you have the whole month of October to get your documents ready and everything. And now what you have to do to apply is you will click here to the application and once you click on that link you will be landed on this page and again you can see the eligibility criteria here and then when you can apply and how you can apply so in order to apply you have to create an account and you can read the instructions here visit the traineeship offers main page so you have to go to this page and then you will apply for the traineeship so, so you can see that the traineeship is not available right now because the applications will open in october so you have time to prepare your documents and then as soon as the application portal opens just start applying right away and if i go back to the main page here we can see what documents we need so you just need an id or a passport a university diploma and a criminal record that's it it is highly recommended to have all the required documents ready to be uploaded before receiving the shortlisted message. So let's say you apply for the March traineeship and if you get shortlisted, you will get the notification on these dates. So that's it. It is so easy to apply. Don't miss this opportunity. The second traineeship that I'm going to talk about is European Economic and Social Committee. So again, this is also offered twice a year and the eligibility criteria is university graduates who are nationals of the member states of the european union but again they also have a number of seats available for people from non-eu countries which i'll show you later the duration is five months these are the starting dates either 16 february or 16 september 
and again the language requirements are the same and the payment is 1229 euros per month plus travel allowance so wherever you travel from they will cover your travel expenses and the deadline is 30th september or 31st march and this is in brussels let me open this pdf now to show you the eligible countries so here you can see under eligibility criteria trainees are selected from nationals of the member states of the european union however a limited number of nationals of non-member states can also be accepted on condition that the applicant fulfills all legal requirements concerning work or residence permits in belgium so if you are from a non-eu country you can definitely apply and if i go back to the main page so you click on this link to apply for the traineeship long-term traineeships and the applications for this traineeship is actually open you have to click on the online application so once you click on that application link you will be on this page and what you have to do is you have to create an account and then fill in your basic info and tell them your education experience and whatever they will require from you you have to submit but it's a very easy thing and it doesn't require a lot of time and then you choose the unit that you want to apply to so now let me show you the units that you can apply to so these are the units that you can apply to and you can apply up to three units and you can see there are many units human resource hr hr budget finance account infrastructure it and a lot more so the applications for this traineeship are open and let me show you the deadline to apply so the deadline to apply for spring traineeship is 30th september so you still have a few days to apply so that's it these are the two traineeships that you can apply to if you are from a non-eu country and if you are from an eu country then you have unlimited opportunities you can apply to all the traineeships that the eu is offering and the best part is that you will be working like a full-time job and you get two paid leaves every month you get paid every month and if you are traveling from a distance they will pay you for the travel expenses it's very very easy to apply you don't have to pay anything you just need a good cv a good cover letter if they ask for one and you're good to go so i will highly highly recommend you guys to apply for it even if there are few spots for non-eu countries do go for it because it doesn't require a lot of time it doesn't require you to pay anything so just try to apply for every opportunity that you can apply to because you never know what the destiny holds for you this was it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it and please let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions i will be putting down all the links in the description so you can apply to these traineeships and a lot of videos are coming i will be posting them soon so stay tuned and i'll see you guys in my next video bye